YouTube, how you doing? It's the Jokester here, back for another video. I hope you're having a good day. I'm having a good day. It's a little cold, it's a little cloudy, but I got a package today. I got another one, and I know I just did an unboxing the other day, but this was a day or so late. And what we got right here is a pink bubbly wrap stuff. I know what you're thinking. That's a pretty gay color, jokester. And you would be right, it is pretty gay. But you know what's not gay? What's inside it? So let's open that, shall we? Because this is from Limited Run Games, yeah! America, if yeah! So let's open it, shall we? Open it. Oh, open it. Oh, 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 oh yeah. You like the way that I open that, don't you? Don't you? Oh, it feels so good, don't it? Oh, yeah. It's so sticky. Yeah. Why is this so freaking hard to open? Oh, yeah. I opened it. I opened her up. <laughs> that color was in the gas can. Okay, so what we got inside is a limited run sticker that is backwards because the camera is rotated the other way. But a limited run sticker, yeah, that's pretty cool. It was put those in. Then we got limited run postcard thingy. Shows all their games to check off. Not going to show what it is yet because I want to show you what the game first. What else we got in here? What else? What else? What else? Um, what the heck is this? This is new? Um, limited run. This counts as one ticket toward a limited run game loyalty reward. Details at limitedrungames.com pages slash rewards. Yeah, this is a new thing that they're doing. Every event printing. Huh. So I pretty much... You get these tickets, you can save up a bunch by, you know, you get them by buying limited run game stuff. You get, you get these tickets, you save up a bunch, and then you can use them to redeem a upcoming release. So, if you manage to snag a bunch of limited run games, um, you stock up these, wait for a release that's coming out that you really, really want, and redeem it for that. If I could get a bunch, they just started doing these recently, so my past games that I got from them don't count. This is the first ticket I got from one of their releases, which kind of sucks. Um, but if I can manage to stack up a bunch, I'm probably either going to use it for physical copy of Sultan Sanctuary on Vita or PS4, or a physical copy of Yai's Origins. Because, I, I mean, it's it has to be a... An upcoming release it can't be an older release which sucks because I would have used them on the Shanti games but you know it is what it is um so anyways the feast to resistance the game that we got and this is a big thing by the way BAM Ray Gigant physical copy PS Vita Ray Gigant now, this is a big deal, and the reason why this is a big deal is because this is a Namco Bandai game. That's right. Limited Run Games usually does small indie studios, things like that, but this is a big company, a AAA company game that they got the rights to make the physical copy of, which is a huge deal for them, a very, very huge deal. Um... I think this had about 6,000 copies, five or 6,000 copies, can't really remember, but this is really, really, really freaking awesome. Um, a thousand kilobytes install. This is a story-driven um, visual novel slash JRPG dungeon, dungeon crawler game, and it says on the back, submit to fate, oppose fate, gather under fate. 
Guided by Fate plays through three different points of view to uncover the mystery behind what's happened to this world. Slash Beat Mode. The rhythm-based battle action system. Slash Beat Mode allows characters to unleash their hidden power or transform transformation by offering their bodies to their Yorigamis, which is, I guess, their source of power. Keep uh, skyscraper-sized bosses and battles with three-way views. For special boss battles, each of the characters will utilize their special abilities, varying from close-up to long-range on the field. And this is the number 50. This is the 50th um, game that they released. So, congratulations for releasing 50 titles. Congratulations for your 50th title being a AAA studio Game, man, th and then you got Yai's coming. That's like, I think, what's that? That's a fam uh, Famcom game. I mean, Limited Run Games is just going up and up and up, and they're getting more popular, and they're going to get better games to make physical release. I'm really hoping they get Caligula, I believe it is. It's. I think that's the way you pronounce it. It's, it's basically that new RPG from the guy who created, like, the original... Persona games, the, like the first two, um, or the first three. So that's a really big deal, and I'm really hope we get in a physical of that, because all we're getting is a digital release. And I'm really hoping they will get the rights to do the physical copy for that, because I want a physical copy of that. I want physical Vita games. This costed me $40 plus shipping, $45. That's pretty expensive expensive for a Vita title, but this is a, this is a big deal for them. I mean, this is a big deal, and you know, it costs like 30 or 40 dollars for the digital copy. I'm not gonna pay like over 20 to 25 for digital games, or season passes, or you know, expansion packs. So, Getting this physical copy was a big deal because this was the only way I was going to buy this game unless it went on sale for like 20 or 15 or 10 bucks. Because I managed to score the physical, I got this game. And if I didn't, I wouldn't have ever probably played it because it probably would have never went down in price. I really hope... They'll get other rights to other studios to get physicals. I would love if I Am Setsuna got a limited run release. The only, like, English text-based game there was was for the Switch. And that was, like, a Asian, you know, English multilingual release. But it's completely sold out. I can't even buy it at Play Asia. So, and we all know how crappy the Switch is and how... Uh, the games are overpriced in how, you know, the quality control event system is worse than a Fisher price toy. So, yeah. I'm really hoping they get the rights to do a physical copy for that. Um, for um, that new game that recently came out. What is it? What is it called? Um, goodness, I can't think of it. Um, the one with, like, the animal characters is the RPG. Uh, Shyness. Shyness. Yes, it's Shyness. I almost forgot. I couldn't think of it. I want a physical copy of that. Really disappointed. That game's like $30 digital. Come on, Limited Run Games. You're getting bigger titles. You're getting Yai's and you're getting a Namco Bandai game. You're getting Yee's and, and this. So, I believe in you. You're only going to go up and up. And I just hope you make more... <laughs> Get more stock of each game because the more people that know about you, the harder it is to get this. So, thank you for this. Thank you for this sticker. Thank you for the really cool art poster board thing. This is really cool. And thank you for um, the ticket for getting them, possibly getting a free game. I love Limited Run Games. Definitely support them. I will put a link to their website down at the bottom. They have a Twitter, and you can follow them on Twitter. You can follow them on Facebook. Um, also, follow the the two guys behind the company. Um, um, Limited Run Doug, Limited Run Josh, I think they go by on Twitter. I follow them. They're great guys. I actually love Doug. He's awesome. He's awesome, dude. He loves Dragon Ball Z. So, you know, I got to love my fellow Dragon Ball Z fans. 
Um, but yeah, definitely support these guys. Definitely support this company. They're doing a great thing for us gamers. You know, and I'm just, I'm happy to support them, you know, with every single penny that I have. And I'm going to keep on supporting them. Even if it gets harder to get the games, I mean... This sold out. The, I got the. I got up in the morning. I woke up an hour early. It was like nine for me. I think I woke up at seven or eight to get a copy, and this literally sold out after about three minutes of me checking out and getting mine. It was already down to ten percent. So I'm pretty sure Yeez is gonna go even faster than this did, and I'm really hoping I can get the copy of that. If I can't, I'll get the multi language. Asian version, but I really wanting the limited run version because it's like supposed to be like a collector's thing So We'll see But until next time this is the jokester Signing out see ya and please Check out limited run games. They're amazing. They're amazing guys and uh, Thank you. Thank you limited run for what you do till next time See ya